Once upon a time, in the bustling city of New York, there lived a very peculiar dog named Bentley. Bentley was not your average everyday dog. No, Bentley was the richest dog in the world, and he lived in the most luxurious place imaginable. Bentley was a golden retriever, but he was no ordinary golden retriever. He had inherited a vast fortune from his late owner, a wealthy businessman who had left all of his wealth to his beloved canine companion. As a result, Bentley had become the richest dog in the world with a net worth of over $500 million. He had all the finest things in life, including a massive mansion in the Hamptons, a fleet of personal chefs, and a wardrobe filled with custom-made designer outfits. The mansion where Bentley lived was a sprawling estate, complete with a private dog park, a swimming pool, and even a personal doggy spa. Bentley wanted for nothing, and he was certainly not afraid to show it. His mansion was the talk of the town, with rumors swirling about the opulence and excess that could be found within its walls. But despite his wealth, Bentley was not a spoiled or selfish dog. In fact, he was quite the opposite. He used his fortune to help other animals in need, donating millions of dollars to animal charities and shelters around the world. Bentley had a heart of gold, and he wanted to ensure that all animals had the chance to live as comfortably as he did. Every year, Bentley would host a lavish charity gala at his mansion, where he would invite other wealthy dogs and their owners to raise money for his favorite animal causes. The event was a glamorous affair, with celebrities and socialites attending in droves, eager to rub elbows with the richest dog in the world. But despite his philanthropic efforts, Bentley was not immune to controversy. Some people criticized his lavish lifestyle, saying that he should not be living in such excess when there were countless animals in need. Bentley paid no mind to these critics, knowing that he was doing his part to make the world a better place for animals everywhere. As Bentley grew older, he began to divide his time between his mansion in the Hamptons and his other lavish properties around the world. He had homes in Paris, London, and even a private island in the Caribbean, where he would spend his days lounging in the sun and sipping on coconut water. But no matter where he traveled, Bentley always made sure to give back to the animal community. He funded research for Anima, 